So I've just come out of the Cybos session on Capital Markets Union and uh, building the single market for capital, particularly looking at financial market infrastructures. A really important session. Virtually everybody in the room, I think, supports the principle of building a capital markets union in Europe. And by that I mean a market whereby capital financial services can circulate around the European Union freely on the basis of competition, on the basis of good rules, on the basis of enforcement and supervision. We need to accelerate the financing options for European firms, for European consumers, drive down the cost of capital, widen the supply of investment opportunities. And we've got to do it fast. And if we don't do it fast, the politics, new types of polit political forces, some of them very ugly, are beginning to make ground. For me, the big takeaway here is the politics. Can we find the collective political force in the European Parliament and the European Council, that's where all the member states work, to deliver these agreements? And these are not just technical issues about financial market infrastructures. They are about things like developing a pan-European pension product, making infrastructure investment work, in improving and understanding each other much better on insolvency, breaking down this discrimination between debt uh, and equity, creating an equity culture in Europe, which is actually very good for financial stability. <laughs> but these are big issues and they need political support from the highest levels of the European Union if they're going to be achieved. Thank you.